about the greatness that is Shauna Rhimes. Um, why was now the right time to say goodbye to, to Riggs on the show? Well, it's never the right time to say goodbye mm -hmm. to Riggs, is it? You know? Yeah. Um, I think, though, that the characters sort of served purpose in a way. I think, I mean, my involvement was always going to be relatively short term. I had a small term contract, so that was what we agreed on and um, so I was but I was unclear as to exactly how they were going to use rigs it was obvious that I was going to perform some function in terms of Meredith's you know getting back into a romantic relationship and navigating that um, but I never knew exactly how it was going to be played out um, and I was quite surprised I mean I, I knew Megan was going to come back I knew there was going to be a triangle and it was probably going to end horribly but I actually didn't know it was going to end so sweetly for Riggs um, so it was kind of nice and a shock in, in, in Grey's to have such a nice send off you know? right. it's rare for the show that, that kills off everybody I know I know I'm, I, so I take that as a, as a compliment um, and you know and the, the door is obviously open for you know something down the line if that serves the show um, and, but we've also talked about doing other stuff together you know and this is I think our third or fourth time working together so you know for me it's, it's just been nice to come back into a family that I've always been treated so kindly with and to be a part of something that's so well loved for a few years and but, you know now it's sort of for me it's nice to kind of also look at new horizons and I'm not one to do anything one thing for too long right what's your message to all of your the fans that you got from Grace now you got millions and millions of people who are so sad to, that, that you're, you're off the show I know and I, I I just want to say thank you you know to those people who are so supportive I think introducing a character like Riggs and it was intentional you know they they the writers really played on whether you know do we love him do we yeah. hate him and it, it that's really, the best character to play yeah about. it was fun and it riled a lot of people up and people were like you're not McDreamy and no there's you know and then other people were like no but Meredith needs a new love interest and it was really fun to be a part of that where people you know they were so passionate about it and, and as a consequence yeah there were a lot of people that you know became fans of me and the character and that was it was an honor, you know, and it, it was just amazing to go to work knowing that there was this incredible fan base that loved what you did. So I'm very and grateful. Last, last thing, we're here to celebrate Shonda Rhimes and a few other people. Just really quick, what is it about Shonda that just makes her worthy of this honor? On television? I mean, look, Shonda's. But again, I don't know. She's a powerhouse, you know. She's just an incredible font of talent and incredible work ethic. I mean, that's the one thing that I've over the years gotten to learn about her that I'm sh sort of shocked by just because I don't think I mean I wish I had the work ethic that she does and you realize you know when you see her in action and the attention to detail and her commitment you realize why she's as successful as she is you know aside from talent clearly she's got bucket loads of that but there's this commitment and this, this utter dedication to what she does that I think you know the industry benefits from and, and the audience obviously do so you know it's just nice to turn up tonight and honor someone who's so incredible you know and, and to be a part of that family you know it's, uh, it's an honor for me too. Well nice to meet you. We'll see you nice to meet you man. Project. Pleasure. Yeah thank you.